people gain three-dimensional information from a variety of cues. Two of the most important ones are binocular parallax, seeing a different image with each eye, and motion parallax, seeing a different image when you move your head. We have built a display that provides both of these three-dimensional cues to multiple users without the use of glasses. We have also built a complete 3D television system that allows for real-time acquisition, transmission, and display of dynamic three-dimensional scenes. All of the footage in this video shows live scenes that were simultaneously acquired, transmitted, and shown on the 3D display. In the acquisition stage, we use a linear array of 16 FireWire video cameras. These cameras are hardware synchronized and connected to a cluster of eight producer PCs. Each PC controls two cameras. In the transmission stage, the producers capture and compress the video streams and then send them over a broadband network to the receivers. In this prototype, there is no digital cable network, so the producers decode the video streams immediately. In the display stage, Eight consumer PCs receive the decoded video streams over a gigabit Ethernet network. The consumers use data from the various video streams to render the views that are necessary for the 3D display. Each consumer drives two projectors. A total of 16 different views of the scene are projected onto the 3D display. A single lenticular sheet focuses the light from different views onto a reflective surface as vertical stripes. The reflected light then passes back through the lenticulars towards the viewers. The overall effect is that 16 views of the scene are visible from different positions in the viewing area, resulting in a 3D image with binocular and motion parallax to multiple viewers. We now show more shots of dynamic scenes from our 3D display. We can stop the transmission of the multi-view videos and freeze the current frame. Note the strong motion parallax in the scene. The 3D display is generally in focus for all views, with a slight blurriness for small features. The three-dimensional effect is visible from a broad range of viewing positions, from very close to very far away. The distributed architecture of the system makes it scalable in the number of acquired and projected views. Note that the frame rate does not change as we keep adding more views. We will use this 3D TV prototype to gain new insights into the technical and psychophysical issues surrounding three-dimensional television.